came back 95 on Maya form as I'm trying to hang a flag no matter what I do whether it's a plane or a cube that has been scaled down it keeps applying on natural stretch to the attached transform constraint as in the screenshot resulting in a very unnatural simulation where Moses geometry is unaffected and the geo where it's attached it's a stretch rally I can increase the stretch resistance and the other attributes is this the only solution let's take a look of the screenshot and then okay so then let's try to recreate this so let's create a plane i won't scale too big since you mentioned that you already scaled down quite a bit and clock and create and constraint so that looks okay let's lower the space scale all right so i think we're getting what we want here so what you're saying is these links are edges are stretched out more than usual and it's probably because you know adding the end constraints there so as far as i know whenever you create end constraint it kind of give different sets of rules and things tend to be heavier it's kind of hard to answer exactly why but i guess that's a question probably for autodesk but i do have a few solutions for this that's Get rid of the end constraint. First thing first, I can we can try to get more points instead of just two points. I think with the one point constraint, it's it's too much stress for the constraint to taking care of and and hold on to the whole cloth. So if we select more points and then create a constraint, it's going to give a more support, and then therefore you see the stretch. On the transition points or links are much better right so that's one solution uh, the second solution is we can also instead of using end constraints we can use input attract Okay, so I'll select these two points, back to input a track, we'll do 100% there, and simply simulate. So as you see, the, the link in between are a lot better. Uh, we can even, I don't know, maybe we'll just duplicate. All right, we'll make this a cloth, and we'll do we had before and then just compare the two right so that's a couple solutions that you can do and well even better here there's one more solution that you can do is a change your stretch resistance but in addition to that you can also up the sub steps and then that's also going to give you a little bit a little bit better solve for those transition points. So uh, I hope that helps and um, good luck.